Cedars, the man, the 2017 national champ from Texas. Hi, Dustin. How are you? I think we lost him again. I wonder if it's his internet. I, I don't know. I wonder if uh, we should try a different voice channel or hear him. Then we'll just have to use a translator, maybe. Yeah, maybe. Excellent. Or here we got this nice board. We got Snaggles Gaming doing the live stream. Yeah, thanks we'll to, take some uh, time. Wesley Allen yeah. Summers for making that beauty. It's, it's really nice. I like the backdrop. Got to thank Brad Boyles and uh, uh, Bob Murdoch for all the tokens they made us. All these custom tokens. They look fantastic. Very sharp, very clear images. Thanks, guys. Yeah, we're lucky we have people to do that because, honestly, I just That's clip so any cool. photo I can get. Oh my gosh, that's what I was doing when I was first grabbing photos, and they were looking pretty choppy, I'll tell you. These guys made it look really clean and crisp. I like it. Yeah, I like it a lot, too. Hey, you're here. Perfect. Sweet. You boys do your thing. I'm out now. Okay, right. yep, just stay in the room. Hey, so, uh, Dustin, can you, you feel like rolling for map choice? Actually, before we do that... Tell everyone what what game variant you or format you decided to uh, choose for us tonight. I asked you, I invited oh, yeah. you uh, over to play high stakes, and I said you picked a format. So what format are we playing tonight? We're playing three hundred modern. Uh, the oh, right. and, so it, and why'd you pick three hundred modern? Uh, I, honestly, uh, I, I I couldn't um, decide, and I figured if I'm playing the uh, the greatest of all uh, time, we should maybe well. just go ahead and. Stick with something simple <laughs> so it doesn't get too crazy. <laughs> My go to, anyway. I really like it. So, um, <laughs> me too. How about you and I roll for initiative? See who gets map. It's you, sir. Okay. You pick map. Where would you All like right, to go? I think assume... We will go assume on Prison so, 42. But... And you're, you're... Roger. Let me go in my library and grab it. Mm -hmm. No, but not that I'm... One second. Rotate that. All right, how does that look to you? Pretty good so far? That looks great. And let me get my, now, you know I'm proxying with a physical map here on my end, so give me just a second. Okay. And I'll set up the map as well. All right, I'll leave the map as is, and how about, uh, do you mind if I take, I'll take lettered side if you don't mind. No problem. Cool. All right. Set up. I'm going to set up my physical board first and then I'm going to drop my, uh, my digital one. Sure. I'm going to go ahead and set the map to map layer. Oh, thank you very much. Hey, uh, Josh, could I get some help here? I can't get them to snap into the correct squares. I'm here. I'm, uh, usually it's because the map's a little off is what it is. Oh, I gotcha. So... Eyes or just is that? If not, I have one, George. I could just upload mine. I believe I uh, go ahead. Okay, 
Actually, I don't think I do have one. Let me see if mine will snap in a point somewhere better. If not, it Ooh, might off. be the background, yeah. In a second. We might have I to think go... The I, th I think the figures are lined up with the background. It looks like the map is just a little bit off. I think. Yeah, okay. The map is just a little bit off. That's weird. Why won't it... Uh... Yeah. Maybe it's the wrong size? Is that it? 4 by 36, right? Yeah. Wait, let me go into uh because that looks nice. right there that looks good oh, there we go is it the right okay. size i'll just have one empty layer i think so okay perfect no that's good as long as it i was sweating it there for a minute yeah they're all snapping perfectly now okay let that, me know if that, you... that works oh, oh, oh. let me know if you guys need anything else I think we're good. All right. Let's see. There we go. All right. All right. Let me put my boxing ring out. I'll put this let me set this the map layer so you know what my bearing my ring just disappeared <laughs> let's try that again mm. All right, let's try this again I place the map. I set it as choose a layer, map layer, and it disappears. Son of a gun. Give me one sec, I will figure that out. Yeah, thanks. Okay, I'm going to keep doing my pieces until then. <sighs> Lots of stuff, man. I just asked that helpful guy, Wes. I know he's hanging around. Nice. Tell him I said thanks. Yeah, and I think I am ready to go. I'll give you a Leslie once you're done. Thanks. Almost done setting up the physical map. Give me one second. Oh, yeah, yeah, you're good. No problem. There. Minutes. Six. All right, let me start dragging this stuff. Here. Good. Okay. 
can move, one can move it. Two light objects. Okay, today and H J K. J and J. Okay. Ooh. Ape. Give you a Dick Tracy. Does that look at everything? I gotta get rid of one of these Cyclopses. Let's not use. Um, <laughs> one chase, one super rare. How about that? No token. I kept the uh, I kept the super rare. I eliminated the chase. Roger. Yeah, I got one chase, one super rare. Okay. Mm -hmm. I see if I see like a dragon new ring into the into the uh, into the game. I don't know why it disappeared like that. Try setting it to GM. Info it's got to be underneath only. the map. I mean, I have to switch the layer, but I don't know how to do. That. Let's bring it in again. There it is. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five. One more. Oh, yep. Okay, now I'm going to try to set this as the map layer again. Okay. All right. Sweet. So, yeah, I look good? You look good, right? I'm going to give you a Leslie. Let me give you my Leslie Pog. Next to sir, and I'll let you give me yours. All right. I think we should be all set. Let's see, I want it to be. I right. want here, I'll give mine. Okay, thank you. All right, so I figure it's about it's ten o'clock, like right on the nose, man. What do you say we go? Just uh, let time go, and we'll check in and see how we're doing it. Like, um, like eleven fifteen. You know, digital play takes a little longer, and we'll see where we're at and go from there. Okay, if you want to keep playing, we'll keep playing. If the game's still going. Me. Yeah, sounds good to me. All right, you are first, sir. All right. So let's see, the first thing we're going to do is, I don't need to roll leadership, so let's uh, move with Ironheart. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, I don't really need it, but I may as well do it. Ironheart's going to move and pick up the Venom Arnis. Then she will sidestep and drop it underneath Kirk, who will... We'll equip it. Gotcha. And then overdrive will sidestep, bringing along the pocket tank. Free action. Free action, Two. turn the uh, object into charged up. Uh, okay. Well, looks like it's under the object, but I don't know how to switch it. Sorry, you didn't tip the figure out a second. That's an action token for overdrive.
And then we're going to sidestep. Um, bring sure. everyone here. Here we at? And okay. Sam Cap will perplex up uh, Surger's mm -hmm. defense. Giant Girl will sidestep. One, two, three. Uh, Groot will move. Fourth action. I'm going to sidestep my walking wood, sidestep this walking wood, okay. and I will pass turn. Let's see. Walking woods. Hang on. I'm just moving your stuff. One, two, one, two, sidestep. So I've got, I've got Ironheart with a token. I got Kirk with a token. I got charged up or, or overdrive who's off the map. I got Groot with a token. That's the four, right? Yes, that is it. All right. Let's see here. Six, seven, eight. Do you belong to like any group in Texas? Like uh, like a team, like a clicks team. Do you have anything like that? Yeah, I'm a member of the Uncanny Clicksman. Oh, uh, we're a team. You're in your group. I'm sorry. How many are in your group? We have uh, we have quite a few players. Uh, uh, the guys who travel, uh, there are probably have a core of about ten of us, and it's uh, it's me, it's uh, Caleb Reddick, who I think you know, and um, <laughs> nice guy, I like him, good guy, and uh, I think he might be watching. Uh, we've got Mike Eskew, Zach Coffee, Charles Garst. We have the Cockrell brothers, Jake and Josh. We've got a uh, couple of new guys. We've got uh, a guy up in Colorado named Justin Harner. We've got uh, Brad Broyles. Uh, uh, gosh, we have a bunch of guys. I know I'm forgetting some, and they'll probably let me know about it. But it's just uh, that's just a few of our guys. Those are those are the main guys who travel. We have a lot gotcha. of guys who play yeah. a little more a little more casually. Sizable group. We're uh, we're not a very, I mean, we have some competitive players, but we don't really just seek out competitive players to be on our team. It's it's guys we, it's our friends and guys we like to play with and guys we just like as people for the most part. Gotcha. We're pretty nice about it and the clicksman. If we can do. Hang on, I'm getting my. I want to come out. I think with my iron heart. I just want to get my positioning down correctly. Sure. All right, let's try this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. All right, you're, you moved. I want to be. I have to be aggressive. I think at this point, because you are going to be in my face next. So I'm going to. I'm going to take Iron Heart. Uh, do you mind moving the, my my characters for me? If I just call it Grid Squares, do you mind doing that? That's fine. Well, I'm going to take Iron Heart carrying Sam Cap. He's going to go up to square thirteen. 13 Foxtrot. I'll give him. Gotcha. Three, four, five, six. Mm 
six, seven. I'm gonna have to go that far. I can hang out and um, you know, make a twelve fox drive. Just back them up one square for me, and then I'll then drop a token. Cap. Drop Sam Cap in thirteen. Thirteen. Um, what is that? Echo. Thirteen Echo is Sam Cap, and then the Pin Pocket Tank will follow in twelve Echo. <laughs> but need a little bit of luck. All right, so let's give Sam Cap a token to call out uh, my Professor Xavier. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And we'll put him in squares. 13, 13 delta. Right adjacent to Sam Cap in the pin pocket tank. Okay, Professor. Other rare one. Here, let me see if I can grab him for you. You got it right there? You got him. Awesome. Okay, then he's going to do his mind control tank thing. First, I'm going to perplex up his attack to a 12. It's going to drop back down to 11. Target um, where we can. So we can go over here and help these 2d6. He has 8 range, correct? 8. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, eight, 6, seven, eight. So I'll get Ironheart and a Walking Wood. I will roll Shape Change for my Walking Wood. Go right on. Okay. Yeah, I got the shape change for the walking wood. Okay, let's do, let's see what happens. I think. Um, That'll, that will miss. I think everybody, right? Golly. <laughs> okay. And this is another game I played against one of your uh, uh, I think buddies. He, yeah, I think you needed <laughs> what, a six, a six, oh, you needed a, you needed a six. A seven. <laughs> Oh, I think Kirk is like the lowest defense, right? Yeah, Kirk's a 17. Yeah, Sam, to... Sam Cap had perplexed him up to us, uh, 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 an 18, though. But I think you only had a range on Ironheart and uh, Walking Wood with that Professor X. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Yeah, I, can get, I think I can get to row 21. And that's it. Okay, so he misses. He gets a token. Hmm. Sidestep Iron Heart. One, Hit. two, carrying Sam Cap. Okay. Uh, gotcha. We'll drop him. Drop him in square. One, two, backwards. Backwards one, two. Behind. Yeah. All right, let's try that. So we're gonna drop him. We're gonna move sidestep him to uh, ten hotel. Okay. Let's see if I can do. You know, might. Okay. Thanks for doing that for me. I, I got it. We're gonna drop Sam Cap in nine. We'll put the particle tank or the pocket tank in nine. They're like that. One, two, three, four, five, six. Um, before I forget, let's have Xavier outwit um, it just because. What outwit? Uh, Xavier's going to outwit. Um, your iron hearts that way. Gotcha. Got it. One more action and a couple side steps I gotta take care of. So why don't we uh, let's sidestep giant girl. I'm gonna carry green arrow. So I'm gonna move her. Okay. Uh, one, two. Two. 
That looks great. There, the side steps back. Well, let's just move these walking ones. That'll be easy. One. Two, walking wood, picking up the light object. I'll just set it up here so you know he's carrying it. Okay. One, two, object. I'll set it up here. Two, one, two, one, two. Two, the ape, side steps. Girl, one, two, she'll carry. Gosh, let's carry. How about. I'll leave Gordon there. You're getting a real pick all of a sudden. I was hoping to hit and drop my tank. Just need that darn set. Let's see. <laughs> One, two, two, two. We'll move to the corner. I'll give him a token for that. Okay. Are you giving me red tokens? All right, that'll be fourth action. Uh, giant girl still sidestepping. She's going to carry. She'll just take Gordon with her, I think. Yeah, we're going to put Gordon over here, though. Pose. Sidestep green arrow over here. Any perplexes? No, he's not perplex. He goes there. Excuse me. Reach in the corner. We give him a token. Two, two, and that's my go, man. I'll say it's on you. All right. Let's see. I don't need to roll leadership this turn, so. I think I need to be aggressive as well. <sighs> I am going to go here. I have to deal with those things. Not so bad, I guess. Yeah, we're going to try that. Um, I'm going to move. One, two, three, four. Six first, and I'll save the perplex. You have a 20 defense. Uh, one, two, three, four. We're going to uh, move Ironheart. Give her a second action okay. token. To click number two. Um... Sam Cap is going to save her perplex. We're going to move. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 10, 11, 12, 13. Move right here. Uh, right here with uh, overdrive. I think that I work. Gotcha. One. Does that work right there? This is the boxing ring. I'll get minus two. I don't want that. 
Um, I think we're gonna go over here. Yeah, right here. Uh, dropping. Dropping. There, dropping Louis Kid. Dropping Ironheart. Okay. Sam Cap. Here, and there. dropping my tank. Tank up there. And your tank. Okay. I got gotcha. you. You ready? All right, so yeah, Kirk is yep, I got it. I'm following. Okay, Kirk is going to free action, activate his Venom Harness, so that'll get him up to yeah. 11 attack, 3 damage. Uh, Whiskid will give him 12 attack, 4 damage. Uh, Overdrive will free action, take him power. That'll give him 12 attack, 5 damage. Um, I guess all to attack. And yeah. he'll try to punch Sam Cap 13 to a 20. Yeah. He'll miss. I will prob with Ironheart, which will also miss. And that was for free. So it is going to be sidestep. Two, three, four, five. I can't get there that way. One, two, three, four, five. I can't get there that way. Back. Okay, so I'm going to sidestep. Square with uh, uh, overdrive. Okay. I can't, yeah, sidestep one, two to there. We'll drop um, WizKid. I need Sam Cap here. We'll leave. Uh, we'll also hit. I'll have to prob it. Yes. We'll hit. Christ. Okay. Good one, man. <laughs> nice. Didn't expect wow. that to happen. You did nine and an eight. <laughs> you fucking hit it all. <laughs> okay. I'm going to try a sidestep breakaway with a uh, Wolverine. I did not get that. <sighs> Gentlemen. Oh, just interrupt um, for one second. Let's see. Yeah. 
all my free stuff I can do this turn. Uh, I can't retaliate on any of your guys because you didn't deal damage. Um, which I will sidestep these pogs forward a little bit. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to rest Groot, rest uh, Overdrive. I don't think anyone else rests. Kirk rests, and then I need to roll for Kirk. I need to roll for roll for Kirk at the end of my turn. He takes the damage, so he'll be on click two. Okay. Yeah. Hmm. And that's gonna be my turn, I think, sir. All right, Josh, did you want to say something? Sorry. Uh, Josh came in and wanted to interrupt with something, but never mind. Oh no no no! Right. I, was just, I was just saying I was ending my turn. Oh, okay okay. Okay. Good turn. Thing. Good round. Jeez. Okay, my Xavier Poos. Cool. <laughs> uh, we just had a bit of an audio issue there. For no, I realized. I think I accidentally rolled a D4, but that's okay. <laughs> All set now? Are we okay? Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm set. All right. Hmm. Oh, well. Here's a token. Yeah, token. <laughs> Wolverine. Mm -hmm. Giant girl. Wait, giant girl uh, has the Colossal retaliate, retaliate before any other Colossals or after the, the Colossals? I can't remember. It goes after. Just making sure. Thank you. But no problem. Hmm. I got the big guy on the other end. They're ready to crush me. Do that. One who actually connected one well, was Kirk, and it was, you know, Kirk missed. Yeah, just Kirk missed Wolverine, it's, right? Yeah, just Wolverine. The big comeback. Okay, so, golly. Fortune for me. Let's. Two. Well, let's um, let's let's break away sidestep first with um, Ironheart. See if I can get this. Okay. Be the um, uh, hopefully he'll just follow me. So he's just gonna break away sidestep. See if I can get it. Six. Cool. Okay. Got it. One, two. Let's sidestep him. Right. So he's here. Excuse me. Just let me know which squares and I can move it for you. Two. We're going to go right here. I'll move. Yeah, like little things, it's not a big deal. I can do that. And I'll place Pocket Tank here. Okay. Let's, um... I think I'm going to outwit. Yeah, Reflex is showing in that guy. WizKid's got a solid 18. Hmm. Let's outwit the Reflexes on SamCap. Take a swing on her. I'm going to push. Okay, so, so uh, what are you perplexing? Uh, I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm outwitting uh, Sam Cap's combat reflexes. What, what did you... And I get a plus one in my attack for being in the ring. What did you use your perplex on? I'm sorry. Okay. Say again? What did you use your perplex on? I don't have perplex. Remember, my oh, Sam Cap's dead. 
Oh, I'm sorry. I thought you said perplex for some reason. I was confused. Ironheart has outwit, not perplex. Right, 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 right. Gotcha. Reflexes. I get a plus one because I'm doing close combat and training. Exactly. So it'll be 11 to an 18. Well, 2d6. R5. Missed again. Okay, so push. Now, um, will Colossal retaliate with Groot? I am Groot. Jump him here. Okay. Got it. Now he's going to make an attack using the tank. I'm going to target Wolverine. So I'm going to get a, a plus one to my attack. For close combat, but I'm going to get a minus one for using the tank in the attack. All right? So, so you'll be back to an 11. Effective. Back to an 11. And you're 17. Okay. And I will, I will prob that with Iron Heart. Yes. A three. I miss. So nothing happens. Um, hmm. <sighs> I'm not going to get options. Giant Girl is going to try the exact same thing from a different square. Third. <laughs> like, this is like where I don't want to be right now. <laughs> Swinging with her. Okay, one, two, three. She's going after Wolverine using the tank. So it'll go back down to a 10, 10 to a 17. Sure. I need I that it. 7. I can do this, man. 7. There goes. 10. I hit it. The pocket tank with the pocket. <laughs> All right. How are, we, how are we placing this bad boy? It's going to be right inside the ring. I'm going to hit every one of your characters inside the ring. So I'll, really go ahead and, I'll, I'll let go you ahead. go ahead and I'll go ahead and move them out and then I'll put them in a spot where you can just place them as you need. Thank you. And I'll go ahead and start dealing the damage and let's see. That'll kill my charged up. It's going to deal one damage to Wolverine. We'll get placed. Right. Let me grab my... Rotate my tank real quick. No problem. WizKid will be on click two. As soon as you're done moving the, the pieces out of the ring, um, I'll move this into the ring. No problem. I'm going to go ahead and roll for uh, my charged up. Yeah. He will take one. Okay. All right, tank. And, uh, he'll pop out wherever you decide to place the car, so I'll just put him out there instead of the car. Save some time. And the object will go in the car's square. All right, it'll be where the car was, right? Here we go. Okay. All right, I don't have too many options for, so let's put, I guess, okay, I've got a Wolverine who's probably going to disappear, so I don't care what he does. I've got an Ironheart, and i got a Kirk on the outside of the ring. My pin tank is gone. Have your, how yeah, this looks at one. Here's one, two, three, four. This kid. Yep. Not a good square, but um, there's a damn cap in here. This kid over there. Sam cap there. Put this kid here. Over here next to Sam Cap and that dude over there. Okay, let's see how. Let's put him on the other side. Okay, do you mind if I replace those characters? Absolutely, you can place them however you want to. I just moved them to the side for you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I think I like this. I mean, this is probably like my best option, I think. Let's put him right. Mm 
need to have that squared. I don't want them to be together, but put over there for now. Okay, so that looks pretty good to me. Mm -hmm. Let me put him right there. I'll put there. That looks a little better, I think. We're going to keep it like this. So I've got one action with Ironheart so far, two Colossal Retaliations. And let's see. Got this guy here. here. Rocking Wood, right? This one? Okay. Two. And I'm going to throw my light object. Done. So I have, I think it's a 10, you have a 16 defense or a 17? I can't remember. I'll tell you one second. On click two, two overdrive is, uh, I can't remember. Is 16 on click two. 16. Okay, need a six. Need that six. Oof. All right, cool. For two, please. Yes, that'll kill him. All right. He goes away. This step and two. They're walking wood. Let me go this way. Three. So, yeah, I think I'll just go towards you. So let's go one, two, like this, sidestepping. Okay. Sidestep the ape. Or, or no, I'm going to move the ape, actually. Might as well go pick this up. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Four, five, six, seven. And sidestep out of number. Okay. So the ape is going to move, pick up Stormbreaker, come back to Green Arrow. Okay. It's going to give him a little token. Ones. And then Green Arrow, he's going to sidestep away, give, dropping the Stormbreaker to Green Arrow. One. Here, I think. Two. Okay, one, two. And they give him a token, a mind map. An arrow is going to take a power action to pick up or equip Stormbreaker. One, two. Little buddy Jim. With the coffee. And one, two, one, two. Three, four. One, two, three. Move, so I've got ape, walking wood. Just three actions. I get one more action. Let's go. Uh, let me give him a token. That's what I forgot to do. Give him a token. And then it's clear on. I think I got everything, right? I think so. Okay. I think so. Okay. All right. A couple of questions. Thanks for that. Was kind of long term. Thanks for waiting. No, 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 no problem. You had a lot to do. The, the clicks right. map, the uncanny clicks map. How that's, do you guys practice? Do you guys like all live in the same city, or is it like California where you're like spread out hours apart, or is it like me where you know everyone's sort of relatively close? And we're like within an hour of each other. And we all play. Yeah, most of us are within an hour of each other. Uh, for the most part, we have a few guys who are out of state, and we practice on Rule 20 a lot. But, uh, yeah, for the most part, I mean, we're all right around here in the Dallas-Fort Worth, Texas area, so we practice with each other a lot. A lot How close are you to um, uh, Ragnarok, uh, Paris' uh, gaming group? They, they live down in Houston. Uh, they're maybe That's a, a four-hour drive or so away, uh, yeah. something like that. That's a few. He's not too far. <laughs> so we we play so, together so a lot. But that would like segue to like the next question is uh, if you guys play online a lot or you use Roll D twenty, what do you what do you think of like the online play versus like physical board play and and what gets lost in translation or or what what's better about each one you think? 
Well, I mean, obviously playing the physical game is a little easier just because you have uh, the access to the dials like in front of your face. You don't have to switch back and forth between different, you know, screens or whatever. Uh, but I like Rule 20 because I can play any time with pretty much anyone. And that really, you know, expands your pool of players that you have to practice against, which just helps make you a better player, I think. So I'm learning. It's like you have like the, the, this ease of access to play anyone at any time, anywhere, pretty much. Exactly. You're missing the dial. You're missing, you know, the actual physical board, and and things are pretty like to me like everything is very small on the on the digital screen. Definitely. But it just has a nice representation of where it's at, and things look a little cleaner when you have people like Brad making. Absolutely. Just continue with your turn. I don't want to interrupt too much. No, no, no. Uh, we're good. I think I'm going to go ahead and start now. I'm trying to decide if I want to try to kill Giant Girl or if I want to try to let her live. Leave her alone. Um, Giant Girl is the one who threw the tank and was successful. So I can retaliate on her, but not Groot. All right. So I'm going to need to be there to, to punch her. 10 to an 18, hopefully I can miss that. I'm going to retaliate with Surter. Okay. Ooh, I think this square. Uh, one, two, three. One, two. Okay, and try to punch you're, you're, you're actually um, on the outside of a wall right there. So, oh, so there the ring doesn't there? actually turn on that wall. Right. It's, that wall is still intact. I, I couldn't tear that down. That might change things a little bit. Hold on. Okay. Yeah, that, that affects things a little bit. Let me see. One, two, three. Two, two, three. That doesn't work. No, that doesn't work. Okay, hold on. That changes right. things a little bit. As, you know, we have time. Don't worry. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm just, uh, let's see. So if I wanted to do it that way, I would have to. Oh, let's see. Uh, Wolverine is gone. That's how I can do it. Okay. Uh, yeah, not quite far enough. Unless I free TK to her. Thank you, Tom. Okay, that works. Okay, so let's see. <clears throat> I think what I'm going to do is retaliate Surter. Okay. Girl 10 to an 18. Hopefully I don't crit miss. <laughs> One can only hope, right? Uh, almost a crit hit. How about that? Um, I'll hit. Okay, so prob with Ironheart. I'm, I'm going to take it. I'm hoping that you'll miss this eight. Okay. Let's see. Rolled an eight. <laughs> okay, she's out. Nice. And that'll hit. that will also deal one penetrating damage to Groot. Of course. Yep. 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 He's out too. Oh my lord. Then I think I want to have Kirk, C C E, um, one and one and try to punch your tank. This is a power uh, CCE. Okay. Oh, wait. I'm outside the ring. Hold on. I'll have minus two to my attack if I do that. Your tank's a 17 defense? Uh, 17 toughness. 16. Nine Sorry. to a 16. I would need a seven to hit him. Uh, that's anything but a sure thing. But I guess we could try it. All right. Um, Got to try it. So we're going to uh, perplex your tank's defense down to a 16. Uh, Kirk's going to CCE uh, one and one, and try to punch your tank. He'll go down to a nine attack defense. Into a six 16. Into seven. I'll prob that with Ironheart. Yes. And that was a power CCE. Good turn. And I think now I'm going to hmm, that to work. 
What have I got over here? I think I can get to you though. Oh, right here. Really needed to kill your tank. I guess I could try the free CCE. Uh, to try. Uh, I don't want to just. Yeah, I'm going to try the free CCE with Kirk and try to uh, punch your uh, tank. Okay. Oh, same dude. same numbers, same everything? Oh, uh, yeah, he's going to go up. Uh, yeah, one and one. So okay. we'll need a seven again. Uh, for three, which I think will kill your tank. Yeah. Two, two will go through and knock it out. Nice hit. And thank you. And, uh... I think that's all I'm really going to be able to do this turn. I might move some people into position. Um, let's see. I'm going to move WizKid to, I think, you have, oh, you equip that object, so you have, what, energy explosion? Move WizKid to... Wait with this kid for right now. He'll stay right where he is. Um, I used the perplex. I used the prob. Step with the walking wood. Side step. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Doesn't work. Yeah, I think that's going to be it for me this turn. I'm going to rest. Kepler's. Iron Heart. I'm gonna rest. Uh, Stam Cap. I'm going to. I'm gonna move uh, a couple of these walking sticks. Actually, I've taken only one cost of action. So, one, two, three, four with this guy. So one, two, three. Oh, it's a wall there. Uh, one, two, three. With this guy. And uh, I'm going to... I think that's going to be it for me this turn. Yep. Here. Okay. Let's see what I see. Let's roll 1d6 for leadership. Okay. No. There, Kirk. <laughs> I step him one, two, put him right there in the corner. This one. Here, I suppose. Step there. One, two. Start so stepping here. Start stepping here. Two, one, two. Quit. Ironheart's probability control with the ape. One, two, three, four, five. Dick Tracy. One, two, three, four. Here. I love the Dick Tracy reference. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let's see. Do I want him there? I don't know if I want him. Two, three, four, five. One, two, three. Keep him on the outside. It just seems. It'd just be a better play. Blue tokens this round. Use the blue ones. Do, okay, so what are the, the uh, prob? Kirk's defense. It is at this point. Oh, did you roll your venom harness last turn? 
Did not activate did you... it. I just used CC. Right, it was just a free because you didn't get moved. That's right. You don't have to activate that apartment. Okay. So on click two, what's his defense? I believe it's still 16. I think it's 16 toughness. It might be 17 toughness. It is... Where are you, Kirk? It is 17 toughness on click two. We're going to try... <laughs> Let's, yeah, let's just go for the flurry on Kirk. I think I want to get rid of him. So you okay. have no, no prob on Ironheart. Let's try to flurry Kirk with the little walking wood and see what happens. So okay. first attack, uh, I missed. You said you're, wait, you're 16 or 17? 17 toughness on click two. Okay, so second attack. That one hits. One will hit. So Kirk will take two. He'll wind up Jeez. on click four. One. All right. That's, um, I call it a day from here. I think I just clear everybody that can be cleared. So I clear walking wood, I clear iron heart, I clear eight Batman. Wait a minute, no, I don't clear just yet. Hang on a second. They have, iron heart has two tokens, one on walking wood and one on ape. Well, I've only done one action so far. Mm -hmm. Two actions. Do some what damage. was your first? I think you've only done one. Oh, you moved to Leslie. Yes. Yeah, so so Leslie. Correct. Leslie. And then do one more. Let's um. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Have Green Arrow do something. Where is action to this? Okay. We're gonna call in. Who are we calling in? Call in the um this again? Something reflexes you said? This click it is sixteen reflexes. Gotcha. Sixteen reflexes. This man. Come on, Gene. Okay. Uh one, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, I think that's exactly what I do. Okay, we're gonna call in uh, Cyclops with give him a token. I'll give him switch into blue because he got this token pulled one off. Hi, right, Cyclops. Where is he? Super rare. Calling in Cyclops, trying to kill me. Four. Right, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna take a, I'm gonna do a run shot. I'm gonna get my side clops. Two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I think it's just one, two, three, four. Surter? Uh, who is he shooting? Surter? Can he see? He can't see through characters. I think I don't think you can see Kirk from that square. No, no, I'm not shooting. I'm shooting Kirk. I'm I'm going after Surter. Oh, you're shooting Surter? Oh, I see. I thought you were shooting Kirk. My bad. My apologies. Yes, I'm not going to go after... I know, I think Sir, Sir is kind of a, a pain in my rear. I, know, I think I want to get rid of him. <laughs> yeah, you need to. <laughs> Tier 18. Yes. I have one prob on it. So I got two shots at this. Let's do it. 11 more hits. Sir. He gets a token. Of time. I'll sidestep and poof away. Over, I used it. All right, that was a good use of the card. And now that's four actions, uh, and I think I am all done. I clear everyone. Okay. So I think what I want to do this turn is over there. Are you over there? If I can't get you. So, uh, leadership's not important this turn. Um, let's let's uh, 
I think I'll which which one I want to retaliate with. I can retaliate on your walking wood. That's the only one I can retaliate on. Okay, so I think we're gonna do is I'm gonna perplex up Kirk's attack with um Sam Cap. I am going to retaliate. Uh, I'll go right here. So Sam Cap's perplexing up Kirk's uh, attack. And uh, Giant Girl will retaliate on your walking wood. Uh, you have a shape change? Yes. Let's roll the 1d6. Before she'll try to punch the walking... She'll try to punch the walking wood with her 8 attack. Or a, a 9 attack since she gets plus 1. Uh, that will hit. He is toast. And then... He is going to move one, two. Actually, first, I think I'll sidestep. I'll sidestep two to right there and drop Sam Cap. And then she's going to move one, two, three, four, five, six, carrying Kirk. Get a token. Uh, Kirk is going to try to free CCE Green Arrow. Uh, Perplexed up his attack, so he has a 12 attack. He'll activate the Venom Harness uh, to give him a 13 and 3 damage. He will CCE 1 and 1, so he'll have a 14 attack for 4 damage and try to punch Green Arrow. Uh, are you sure 14? He only has 10, 10 base attack, right? So he has... He has, a, he has a 11 base attack on click 4. Well, click 4, that's right. He's not on click 2 anymore. He's on click 4. You're right. Yeah. Okay, 11. Yeah, his, his values get a little better as he goes through his dial. Gotcha. Um, okay, so we have 14. Let's see. That will hit for 4 damage. 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. Um, still just one action. So I'm going to move, or I don't want to do this. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Um... One, two, three, four. Uh, what's Green Arrow's uh, defense? He's 16 senses now? Yes, he is. Does Green Arrow have 16 senses at the moment? I believe he is. I'll check. Yes, he does. Yes, he does. So Sam Cap is going to call in Cyclops. Right here. And I'm going to running shot uh, one, two, three, four. Arrow. That will hit. That. And I get a six. Uh, anything? Uh, oh, I need a six to live. Right. Nice hit. One, two, three, four, five. That'll be a blue. Still side to step and poof. Roger. And that's one, two, three actions. I have one more action. Um, I think I'm going to sidestep with some walking wood, sidestep with a walking wood. Mm. And I think that's all I'm going to do this turn. Uh... He's dead, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, Ironheart will move to... Yeah, yeah, I forget. And that's going to be my turn. I'll rest Kirk. I will rest my Walking Woods. Okay, I'd say well, just for the fun of it, I'm going to take one last turn, and I want to call this game. This isn't going anywhere for me. <laughs> Let's... Thanks. <laughs> Damage. I don't know if I get lucky. 
Batman. Let's try to side. Let's try breakaway sidestep with the eight Batman first. Break for. Let's go. Here, I suppose. Let's go right in the, in the corner. We're going to outwit the close combat reflexes on Kirk. And let's let's take a swing on him. I think I need a six or seven. Five. I know it's a miss. I don't think it's a miss. Oh my gosh. I think you maybe hit one attack or something or two. <laughs> this is terrible. Know. All right. That's the way it goes, man. Um, let's let's try Jim Gordon on. Um, I don't know, Kirk. He's on click four, five, six. I don't think he dies. I think it's yeah, him. Him and Sue, I think, are the same. Like seven clicks. We really want to die, but nothing's gonna happen. Um, To, oh, I might be able to do something. Okay, let's sidestep walking wood and pick up the light object that you killed from the last one. So we're going to one, two. Yeah. That's for the, let's go for the gold here. Let's hurl this, let's hurl this object into, um, into Sam Cap. But a 10 on your 17, you're in click two, right? Or click three, so you're. Oh, no, he's, he's a 16 now. Yeah, you're in click three. Oh, and I, actually, he may have taken one because I forgot to roll for his uh, harness, and he would have taken one, but it's still a 16 reflexes. Okay, so he so okay, so then then Gordon will shoot him next. Gotcha. Yes. Yeah. I'm on click five now. Defense. You have 18 defense with Sam Cap with Prob. Bump it. Let's let's throw this object. I need to roll an eight twice. He misses. Object goes away. He gets a token. Take a shot at Kirk. Uh, 10 to your 16. And that'll hit. Let's see what happens here. Um, one, two, three. I do have one action left. Mm -hmm. Let's go for it. Let's take um, one, two, three, four. Ironheart on um, his kid, I suppose. Let's see if we can kill him. I think you're you're attack. So yeah, seven sure. attack on your whatever. Uh, seventeen, I think. Uh, seventeen. seventeen defense. That hits. How how much damage you is it for? I have three? three, but you have prob. You have prob. Don't use it. <laughs> I, I don't have prob. Thanks. <laughs> Wizkid doesn't have prob. Sam Cap does, right? Wait, no. Sam Cap is on click three. I don't think. No, I don't have prob over there. I don't think Sam yes, she does. It, whatever, it's okay. All right, thanks, man. I appreciate yeah, it. It doesn't matter. <laughs> yeah, thanks for the cherry. No <laughs> uh, and that's okay, man. Hey, you know, I'm gonna call it right here. I'm gonna say great game. Oh, wait, no, Gordon's gonna shoot you. Gordon's has to shoot. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I'll do your thing. Yeah, Gordon's gonna shoot. He needs a six. Okay, cool. He hits him for two, and he dies. Okay, so I got a little something at the end. <laughs> but I'm still gonna call it. Yeah, I don't think it's gonna go anywhere past this. You have a. A good Sam cap, a good healthy Sam cap, and um, I can't call in, so I think I'll call here. Dustin, great game, man. Hey, let me, let me pull up this. See if I have any, any questions um, before we sign off. Um, oh, you have you have an event coming up next weekend. Um, he's hosting it, isn't he? What is it? Yeah, yeah. Uh, we're we're hosting a team event uh, here in Fort Worth, Texas. It's uh, going to be at the shop called Sci-Fi Factory, and. Uh, it's basically three man teams with the uh, with the extreme Highlander format, sort of like they used at uh, Lucky Dice earlier this year for the team event that PJ and I think it was PJ, Matty G, and uh, and David Gosselman. I think they won that event. But uh, we're, we're we're having a cash buy in, uh, so and and then a, a cash prize for the for the top eight teams. I believe it's it's prized out for top eight. Uh, Brad has a little. Brad knows more about the pricing and stuff than I do. I'm I'm actually playing in it. But um, there's always an yeah, award toward cash prizes, and I think that a cash prize with like a team tournament at the same time is like a little bonus. Like people like yeah. that kind of. Yeah, we're hoping it's going to be really fun. I know we've got a bunch of guys coming from Arkansas. We have a few guys coming from Alabama, and some guys coming up from Houston and Austin. So it should be pretty fun. 
Uh, there's also going to be a, a sealed tournament that starts with the uh, top eight cut so that if you get eliminated, you have another shot. It's going to be a sealed uh, winner brick of the, of, the new, uh, of the new set. So hopefully it's going to be a... It's going to be a great weekend. Ultra chase, man. Someone's going to get a chance at an ultra chase. Yep. Nice. And they're doing a raffle just for buying into the uh, sealed tournament. They're giving away a brick for uh, as a raffle. Hey, really? Prize, so. Man, that's so, great. That's like oh, a lot yeah. of swag. I would definitely drive out there. If I was like an hour away, I'd go. I would certainly yeah, go. It's going to be fun. Can't wait to see everyone who makes the trip. Wish you could come to Georgia. Can't wait to play you in person. No, I know. We're, we're just a little too far away, but you know, we can still do more things like this. So this is this is Absolutely. cool with me. I don't mind yeah. it at all. No, no, me either. So, so before we sign off, next week, the third, uh, I'm facing off against Steve DiCarlo, West Coast player, who's uh, been pretty popular, doing really good. So next week, I think on the um, Majestics channel, we're going to host me versus Steve DiCarlo in a game of high stakes. So tonight was Dustin Cedars, 2017 National Champ. Thanks so much for coming by, man, and whooping my butt. I appreciate it. Not a problem. Anytime, George. <laughs> Thank you, dude. Hey, Josh, Hello. you still there? Yeah, can you boys hear me? Any, yep, anything you want to say before we sign off or no? I just want to thank everyone that came out to watch. It was a good game, boys. Uh, we had two minor technical issues. We lost sound for about a minute when he killed your Sam Cap. And Josh then... may have stepped away. No, I'm here. I don't think he can hear me. I can hear you. I'm okay. Okay, and then uh, we did have a minor picture freeze there for a minute or two, but I fixed them both. I believe uh, they were on my end, so I apologize about that, George. It's all right. But other than that, uh, good game to both of you. Oh, man. Thanks for hanging out with us. All right. Everybody have a good night. Sorry.